Serbia is one of the most developed and advanced countries in the world. Serbia's economy is one of the strongest in the world. There are many vital components and factors that an economy contains, which enabled him to reach the stage of prosperity and continuous growth, which led to the great industrial development. In this video, we will present the largest current and future projects of Serbia. But first I want the video to reach 100,000 likes. Share the video and subscribe to the channel. Serbia has announced that it will sign a contract to develop a solar energy project. 1 gigawatt nationwide. The new solar power plants will make up 3% of the current electricity generation in Serbia. The planned solar projects will be distributed to about 10 sites in Serbia. With a total area of 2,000 hectares. Compared to the country's current emissions of 51 million tons. These projects are expected to reduce carbon dioxide emissions by 1.9 million tons annually. These projects are expected to be completed in 2023. Including vestments and new power plants. It includes the construction of large hydroelectric power plants, such as Serdab 3 and Bistrica. The Dirdap 3 project will be implemented 1,007 km from the Danube. Nerdap 3 is expected to be built in three phases. The total annual production after the completion of the third phase is estimated at 484 gigawatt hours. The first major investment is expected to begin in 2022. In addition to solar, natural gas and wind power plants to ensure the stability of the power system. The goal is to arrange the construction of renewable energy plants in the next 20 to 30 years. The value of the investments is about 17 billion euros. The Belgrade Metro is one of the most influential infrastructure projects in Serbia. Serbia plans to start construction of the second Belgrade Metro line in 2023. The Belgrade Metro network will initially consist of two lines. It is 22 km long and 19.8 km long. It will integrate four urban railways. Contains 20 stations. The first line of the subway will run along the Sava River. Through central Belgrade, it connects the Mikwisko Burgad district in the southwest of the Serbian capital. In the Maravu region near the Danube in the northeast. The second line will connect Zemun with the northwestern suburbs of Belgrade via New Belgrade Municipality, Murjevo District. The project will be completed in 2028. The total investment of the project is about 4.4 billion euros. Serbia has approved a plan to build a 600 megawatt wind farm. Europe's largest onshore wind farm is located in Serbia. A wind farm will be built in Vojvodina. The wind farm will be built on an area of 6,700 hectares. It will generate 1,000 kilowatt hours of electricity annually, which is enough to meet the energy needs of 200,000 families. Investors will develop this project to completion. Serbia plans to start building a new river port in Belgrade by the end of 2021. Serbia is considering building new ports in three locations. One of them is located near the wetlands of Belarica on the Danube. The potential site of the new Belgrade port is being moved from the Biljerica site. Thus, the construction of the port will not have a negative impact on the environment. And, most importantly, it will not adversely affect some species of animals and plants in the central and southern parts. Funding for investments amounted to about 800,000 euros. Serbia plans to complete construction of a waste-to-energy facility near Belgrade in November 2022. Construction and demolition of waste facilities, CDW. Restoration, closure and rehabilitation of the existing Finca landfill. The waste-to-energy facility will generate up to 30 megawatts of electricity. In addition, 56 megawatts of heat was purchased by the municipal company Beogradska Electrain. 
to reduce the consumption of natural gas in its plant. The value of building a new landfill amounted to 300 million euros. After completing the project, Belgrade will generate 10% of the heat and 5% of the electricity from waste. Serbia announced the modernization and reform of the country's railway infrastructure. This investment will support the rehabilitation of approximately 1,000 kilometers of railway lines, strengthening communication between the state and neighboring countries. The Nice Mitrovgrad and Sabatica Sheged railways are also planned. Construction is expected to start soon. The value of the investments amounted to about $7.7 .7 billion, equivalent to 6.5 million euros. Implementation of the project has officially started. The project extends along the Danube River in Serbia. The project is called Danube Corridor. Its total length is about 68 kilometers. It is a two-way road with four lanes and its design speed is 100 kilometers per hour. The Danube Highway will enhance connectivity between regions. It is of great importance to facilitate the travel of local residents. Improving the investment environment and enhancing tourism potential. It will vigorously promote the future economic and social development of the region. The railway project includes the reconstruction of the 243.5 km line between Belgrade and Nice. It will provide a railway line to Presevo in southern Serbia and Skopje in Macedonia. The niche. Presevo Railway is one of the oldest railways in Serbia. The most important part of the X corridor that runs through Serbia. It has a total length of 151 km and is electric using a single phase system of 25 kV and 50 Hz over its entire length. Trains will be allowed to operate on the Niš Presevo Railway line at a speed of 200 km per hour and a speed of 160 km per hour. The construction project is expected to start in 2021. It is scheduled to be completed in 2023. The project cost is estimated at 2 billion euros. In your opinion, which of these projects is the best in Serbia? Are there projects that we did not mention? Write it down in the comments. Here we come to the end of the video. Share the video and subscribe to the channel.